Question 23. A loudspeaker emitting a sound wave of a single frequency, okay, so we are keeping the frequency constant for now, is placed at a distance L from a reflecting surface. Okay, I can smell stationary wave already because if you think about the condition for standing wave, you have a loudspeaker here and the wave will travel to the reflector and then reflect. A stationary wave is formed with an empty node at the loudspeaker. Okay, boss, I'm going to draw an empty node here. Oh, I will write that this is an empty node. Maybe I'll draw later. Okay, the microphone is moved from the loudspeaker towards the reflector. Before the microphone reaches the reflector, before it reaches the reflector, uh, it detects four points where the sound intensity is a minimum. Minimum sound intensity is note. These are the notes. Okay, because the particle vibration is minimum. So then the sound will be the softest. What is the wavelength of sound wave? Okay, so we're looking for lambda. So I guess the way to do this is to figure out what lambda is uh, for how many lambda we can fit inside from here to here because we have four nodes, four times nodes, okay? And we must start with the anti node here, okay? So let's say we start with anti node and then eventually we will hit, okay, I'm not going to try to draw here because it will be very weird to fit, but what I'll do is I will draw it a bit to the side. So give me a sec to adjust this one a bit. So I'm going to draw this a bit to the side. So we have a loudspeaker here. Loudspeaker. And then some reflector here. Like, okay, I'll put the reflector later. So the anti note is here. And then we have four notes. Okay, so let's say this is note. Okay, I'm going to put it close. Lah. Note. And then we have another note here. Four. Ah. Three. Four. Okay. Of course, we have anti notes inside, but we'll draw them later. But my question is, what happens at the reflector? Do you think the reflector there will be a note or an anti note? You haven't reached the reflector yet, okay? Because if you read this statement, it says what? Before the microphone reaches the reflector. So it hasn't reached the reflector yet. So the reflector is probably somewhere here. This is your reflector. Okay? So this point here will be another note because you are colliding with a hard surface. So the vibration of the air particles would not be that high anyway. Right? So one, two, three, four. This one is before reaching four notes before reflector. Okay, so if you want to calculate the number of lambda, uh, I can sketch the wave profile for you now if you want to. So let's say I use orange and this is an anti node. So these are nodes. Okay, the nodes are here. So the standing wave that I'll get will look something like this. Lah. So this is the standing wave that will form in between this reflector and the speaker. So to find out how many lambda this is, because this entire length is L, here to here is L. No. Okay, here to here is L. Okay, my speaker is not really properly drawn, but you get the point. Okay, so at the speaker, there's an anti note. You find four notes in between the speaker and the reflector, but not yet reach the reflector. So there's a fifth note here that you cannot detect because you cannot put the microphone at the position of the reflector. I mean, you can go close, but you probably cannot touch here. So four notes before the reflector. And if I measure lambda, 
right? Here to here is lambda over 2. Whenever you go from node to node, it's lambda over 2. If here to here is lambda over 2, then here all the way to here will be 1 lambda over 2, 2, 3, 4. 4 times lambda over 2. And what about here to here? Here to here is lambda over 4. And this will be equal to the length L. So lambda over 4 plus 4 lambda over 2 is equal to L. So my L now will be equal to, this is 8 over 4. 1 plus 8 is 9. So 4 over 9 lambda. 4 over 9 lambda. Sorry, lambda is 4 over 9 L. Mm. Okay, lah, I do slowly. Don't skip step. Because for me, I'm just looking for the number, whether it's 9 or 7 or 5. But I guess that is a bit skipping steps. So let's not skip steps. 9 over 4 lambda is L. Okay, so from here, we'll get lambda is equal to 4L over 9. Yeah, so the whole idea is whenever you do st standing wave question, sketch out the pattern by reading the question carefully. The first clue that the question have given you is at the loudspeaker, you will get an anti note. And we can have the mic at the loudspeaker because like, the loudspeaker is an open cone. Ma. Right. And then as you move towards the reflector, you will get one, two, three, four, four notes. And you can draw them in. Okay, and you also know that by the time you reach the reflector, you will get another note. It's all right here for you. Note at the reflector. Why? Because uh, there's less space to move. Lah. Okay, less movement of air particles. Okay, so the answer is 4L over 9. Is there an answer? Yes, there is 4L over 9. Okay, so if you know that, you don't need to sketch this, lah, but at least a useful thing to remember is note to note, lambda over 2. Okay, and then you can just count how many lambda over 2s they are and equate them to L, and then you can find lambda, equate them to L, and you can find lambda in terms of L. Alright, that's it for this question.